Hello, hello, and welcome back to my Tragic on YouTube series. I am Tragic, aka Tragic on Twitch, and I am super excited to have you here. So today will be part three of Amori. If you missed parts one and two, I highly recommend that you go back and watch them, otherwise you won't have any idea what's going on. Uh, though to be honest, I don't exactly have any idea what's going on yet. The way that part two went, kind of, it kind of got creepy. I don't, I don't know what's going on, but I, I, I like that. I keep saying that, but I like that I just don't know what to expect yet. So honestly, I've been dying to play this game again since I recorded part two, and I, I don't want to wait anymore. So let's dive back into Amori. Let's go. All right, so we are back with Amori. So first things first, the last time I saved wasn't actually where we left off in the video, but I think that's a good thing. I told my BFF where I was at, when we did this video last, and he asked specifically if I had checked the mirror in the bathroom after we answered the door. Yeah, that's creepy. That is very creepy. I wonder if I just like watch it for a second. Is it moving? Okay, so I know for a fact we checked our reflection in the last video before we answered the door. So, in case you need a recap, we, at, at the near end of last episode, there was like a knock on the door. I think we thought it was Mari. Mari said something like she forgot her key. Uh, I, I don't totally remember, but I, I believe it was something like that. So we went to answer the door and the door was only cracked and we saw this. I thought it was like an eyeball. I wasn't totally sure what we were seeing, but now we've checked the reflection and clearly, I don't know whether this is Mari or something else creeping behind us, but I mean, I'm glad I got told to check this out, because this is weird. After watching my first video, I paid a little more attention to the beginning sequence where it's, it's I, I think, Sunny here or Mori talking to somebody and they say, like, promise you'll never leave me, something similar or, or to that effect. And when I looked at it, it looked like the person Amori or Sunny here was talking to was Basil. So I'm a little confused on what's going on. Uh, I think that's gonna be the phrase, uh, the theme of this whole series with the Mori, but it looks to me like something happened to either Mari or, or Basil or both of them. And I'm interested to see where this goes. So I think all we needed to do was go to bed and then we'll wake up in white space. So I, I just wanted to show that part since I was specifically told that I should check it out. And I'm glad I did, that was very creepy. Hopefully I didn't miss anything else there, but that was the only thing that was mentioned to me. Welcome to White Space. You have been living here for as long as you can remember. Okay, so this this is where we actually left off at the end of part two, but I mean, we only had to do like one little thing that I wanted to show y'all. So the theories that I'm starting to come up with, it does appear that Amori and Sunny are the same person. And when we're in kind of the real life area that we were just in, Sunny has color. So this makes me think this is either some dream world or, or something in Amori's head. I'm also starting to think either Mari or Basil are, are dead and maybe Amori slash Sunny was possibly involved with their death. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Again, that's that's the theme of this whole miniseries. I don't know and I'm confused, <laughs> but I can't wait to see what's gonna happen next. So let's start checking things out again. Okay, this already, wow. I did not expect something to already start, okay. Collect all keys to fill in the blanks. Incorrect keys will be discarded to the right. This is Hangman? I'm so confused. W what? In the grass near a stump on a shrouded old bridge between giant pinwheels near a cast-off cartridge underneath a wet pillow within a large frame beneath a trapdoor in a lost pyre's flame? What? Okay, clicking these doesn't do anything. Okay, so we have to collect these somehow? Interesting. Press Q to open the hangman menu. Well, since I'm using a controller... 
Something fell nearby. We didn't even have to talk to the cat this time. My sketchbook. Take a look inside. Yes. So this was all here last time. I think we've already looked at this at least twice now. And I remember that- so this was where it ended in the first video, the first time we were here. And then this is new now. They added this. A tissue box for wiping your sorrows. That has a change. I can't click this light bulb. Let's see what the cat says. Meow? Waiting for something to happen? Dialogue is still waiting for something to happen. Okay. I also think last time that the reason I'm asking so many times, I believe it was the last video when we were able to get the cat to say different things. So it said something fell nearby. I feel like what happened last time something fell nearby is I was able to go through the door. But I'm gonna try to check and see. Okay, these weird squiggly arms have got to have something to do with the story, right? They freak me out. Because they chase after you and we can't even battle them. They just like put us back at the beginning. I mean, we're back at the beginning anyway. Let's, let's just go ahead and see if we can open the door. Maybe we can. A white door cast a faint shadow. Do nothing. Nope. I, so I don't know what it is we have to do to get the door to to be openable. I just walked right into noodle arm. Oh, look. Okay, something's actually here this time. You found a map. A map, you say? Wow. Oh my gosh. Okay, so there's, there's going to be like a, a big world, it looks like, that we can journey through. Interesting. They'll have question marks on them, though. Okay. Press RB. Nice! Now it says the controller. Press RB to open the headspace map. Okay. So wait, what was the hangman map? LB. Okay. Very nice. I bet that's all we needed, so now we can probably go through the door. Oop, oop, oh, what, what? I've been using a lot of controllers lately, and I keep mixing up where A, B, X, and Y are. <laughs> what I like to do? Open the door! There we go. It's been opened. So last time we visited our friends, Basil like freaked out at the end and I don't, I, I didn't get, Basil was upset about some photo. So it makes me think it was either a photo of Mari dying or like, or something happening to Mari or a photo of something happening to Basil. And then it cut out, we went to like real life world. Amari, thank goodness you're here. Have you seen Basil? We can't find him anywhere. Oh no! Oh no, they can't find him? Uh-oh. We've only played this for like maybe an hour and a half and I'm already like kind of attached to these characters. I think they did good by making them kids. I'm not I'm not normally a kid person in real life either, not gonna lie, other than my niece and nephew, but I, I don't know. They did, they did something right here with these already because it's hard for me to get attached from only like an hour and a half of gameplay generally. We should all go, we should go tell Mari, okay? She's been worried sick. See if anything's changed. The tentacle's still poking out. Four boys are okay. Same. The egg is squishy. I think it's interesting we can make toast here when in our first, uh, like, battle tutorial, all our friends died and turned into toast. Is this a dead person? A photo of someone familiar, but we still don't know who. That's gonna be significant later, I'm pretty sure. That cat is still freaking me out! Sss. Going out, Amori? Sss. Here is your allowance for today. We got 200 clams! We didn't spend any money or any clams last time. Those are red footprints. Okay, so. Last time, or a couple episodes ago now, I guess, I really wanted to explore left or right, but... I mean, how can I not follow these? Whoa, look at Key! That noise doesn't sound good. Hello? This music sounds different too, I think. 11 keys left. Look, it left like a hole in the ground. What? Okay, okay, hold on. So we gotta check, but that's all it said. Okay, okay, A is there. I already wanna like try to guess it, but I, I mean, what the heck? All I have is two A's. We're playing like Wheel of Fortune? Dude. Wait, is that how Wheel of Fortune works? Amori, you're okay. Oh, look, hugs. Don't worry.
worry me like that. Where's Basil? He's not with you, Amori? No, I'm afraid not. The last thing I remember was sorting photos with Basil in his house. And next thing I know, I'm waking up in Neighbor's room with Aubrey and Kel. At least we found you, Amori. But I hope Basil is okay. Who's going to protect him if we're not there? Don't be such a downer, Aubrey. We'll find Basil for sure. You're absolutely right, Kel. It's at times like these when we gotta stay positive. Hmm. Why don't we go back to Basil's house? There might be something that we missed. That's the spirit, hero. And as always, I'll be here if you need me. How come she isn't helping us look? She can't leave her picnic spots. And also Basil's missing. And what the heck is neighbor's room? I don't know if I need to heal, but let's just do it. You and your friends feel like new! I like feeling like new. New year, new me. Mari's picnic basket. Yeah, let's go ahead and save. So now we don't have to redo that one spot again. See, okay. Sunny, Amori look the same. The color's different though. I don't know, I don't know y'all. Oh look, wait, it's a new poster! Do you think Boss is still here? Boss is still here! Oh, Basil's missing again? It wasn't me this time, I promise. Now leave me alone to repent. Oh, well, at least he's repenting. Wanted alive, Pluto. AKA the ninth planet of the solar system. No reward, sorry. What? Interesting. I'm going to swing to the moon! Okay, planets are being involved now. Wait, maybe you said that last time. Come on, Van, put your head into it. <laughs> I like puzzles. I do not like puzzles. I'm bad at them. Uh, hello, friends. I want this banana. They told us last time it was an eternal banana and no one's explaining the eggs. Can you tell I had a coffee? I'm pretty hyped right now. Yelling a lot. The grass sure feels nice here. Want to join us, Amori? Yeah, yeah, I do. The stars shine brightly overhead. You don't have a care in the world. That was nice. More learned observe. Oh, look, we learned something from that. Tonight's a perfect night for stargazing. I like RPGs because I like the ability to waste a bunch of time talking to people for no reason. And then the game benefits me in that way. Thank you for learning observe. Having fun takes too much effort. So watching my friends have fun is enough for me. <clears throat> You calling me out here, game? Am I Banks? Whoa, hey. What? Ah! We freaked that dude out. How come I can't talk to this one? Hop! And the hop! And the hop! And the hop! And the hop, pop, pop. I think we talked to everybody. Oh, wait, isn't there someone in here? Peekaboo! Joker Jash. Wait, did we talk to you? Nose is my best friend. She can't say much, but she's really smart. Hi, Nose. Nose looks occupied. Okay, I feel like we talked to just about everybody here. Whoa, wait, this mirror was in here before. Whoa! Wait, was it here when we walked by the first time? I am so- I can't tell if, like, I'm tripping out and I totally miss it the first time or if it doesn't show up till after I talk to people. Aw, floating mirror. This is cute. Your friends smile warmly behind you. Contrast in this floating mirror. All our friends are behind us. As opposed to super creepy person behind us, who I think is Mari. Yes, yes, hello, value customer. Welcome to my shop. Please buy something. Maybe we should buy stuff. We have, we, I mean, we have like 332 clams, it says. Um, I don't think I want to make friends or, or foes angry. I don't quite get that. It could be helpful at this point, though, to get some candy and juice. I don't actually know how much we can have in our inventory. Let's get like three of each. I don't... We're probably not at a part where we really need all this yet, but... You know, I haven't looked. Equip... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Pocket. Snacks. Important. Oh, we don't have toys. I'm gonna look at the emotion chart again real quick, just to... Look, you can trash it? Okay, happy is strong. Wait, it also says weak. Oh, wait, happy is strong but weak to angry. It just hit me. Wait, we can make our people happy, angry, and sad. 
I'm thinking to use it primarily on the enemy, but maybe I'm supposed to be using it on us. Because I believe it does give us an option to, to, uh, to like, attack or use skills on other people. And before, I didn't get it. I was like, why is it not... Well, like, why is it defaulting to using the skills on myself and my partners? I don't understand. But now it makes sense. So, like, if the enemy... If I want to make the enemy sad because I think Amori has the most juice, as they call it. Like, magic points, PPE, whatever. Um... I could make them sad, and then the sad is weak to the happy, and make us all happy. Interesting. Okay. Some damage to heart and juice. Oh, be attacking when you're sad, I think, does damage to heart and juice. Okay, that was a good little recap. I'm gonna forget it in two minutes, but I I'm kind of picking it up now. You'd think I'd learn to stop putting feet. Train seat. Okay, so again, I'm not gonna explore. I feel like I kind of should, but also I want to just continue with the main story. So we're just gonna go to Basil's house for now. A flower. Oh, without Basil to tell us things, it's just a flower. A flower. Can I pick this up? Would you like to water this? Yes! It's letting us water the plants! What do you think that does? Wait, hold on. I don't think I really did anything there. Hold on, hold on. How... It's not letting me water them. How water? I'm hitting A on them, but it's not really doing anything. Now I'm hitting just pretty much every button. Nope, okay. How do I know it's doing anything? I wonder if there's something I'm missing here. Can I equip the watering can? Nope, but we sure can equip that creepy shiny knife! Awesome! We're just gonna go on with our business. Not really sure if that watered anything or not, but I sure tried my best. Wait, hold on! Some of them are a different... Were they facing different directions before? I'm spending way too much time on these flowers. I'm gonna keep going. Hi, butterfly. That reminds me of Earthbound every time, but doesn't give me magic. No, look, some of them do look different, I think. A flower. That's all that says now is a flower. Oh no. I feel like- Okay, the game is either gonna straight up just dive into this quickly and be like, yeah, Basil's gone. Or this is a trick and Basil's totally fine. A flower? Question mark? It is a cactus. I don't think cactuses are flowers, but they do blue flowers, right? I would know my cactus is barely hanging on. I think we talked about that before. I also have some succulents that every time I think they're dead, they seem to look not dead anymore. So I've just had these succulents and this cactus out on my porch for like two years. Longer than that. <laughs> some delicious fruits! I don't know why I keep healing when I don't need to heal, but that's fine. I just like to hear that anyway. Beauty friends feel like new! Come on, Amori, have some fruit. Fruit is good for you. I already had fruit. Also, I'll save, I guess. Even though nothing's really happened so far. She must always be in the same spot. So I have a feeling when we explore more, she'll always pop up at the picnic in the same areas. But I think it's more than just like a, a nifty... I, I, I think they're not just trying to make her like this friend that you can save. Like there's a reason she can't travel with us. Or I'm just overthinking it because I'm expecting everything to go badly. Who knows? Is Basil here? Lots of butterflies are here. Here's the shoe. Basil, please be in here. Oh no. Oh yep, oh, oh, I'm already getting goosebumps. That was what we drew at the end of our picture! Or our end of our sketchbook! Basil's dead, isn't he? Well, there doesn't seem to be anything out of the ordinary. Do you think Basil just left somewhere without telling us? I don't know, that doesn't sound like him. He's usually so considerate about these things. I can't talk, dot dot dot. Guys, I'm really worried. Is there nothing we can do? Her voice has changed like 10 times, I'm so sorry. What if we can't find him? What if he's in danger? Stay calm, Aubrey. I'm worried too, but that won't solve anything. Let's go look around the forest. Maybe he wandered off and got lost. Yeah, cheer up, Aubrey. We'll find Basil. You guys are right. Okay, we gotta keep our hopes up. Let's go look for Basil in the vast forest. The vast forest, eh? Small plants, they look a little sad. Is it because he's not here to water them? Look a little sad. Look a little sad. Yes, I'm going to check every single one. Okay, yep, they all say the exact same thing. A bookcase. It's a little dusty. Dot, dot, dot. Uh, uh, uh. 
Uh oh, it was a sneeze. Yeah, chew. Are we getting attacked by a dust bunny? I think I'm just gonna attack like normal. Let's see what its health is like. It's not, it doesn't seem to be feeling emotions. It's not happy, sad, or... Oh, it exploded. Okay. We are victorious! Uh, dust bunny is self-destruct. It was super effective. We found a rubber band! Wow. The fireplace is burning just as Basil left it. A comfortable looking bed. Can't sit in the chair. Okay, so we've explored everything here. What is going on? Okay, this is exactly where the key was. Oh gosh, please don't tell me it's hangman like all our friends are dead or something. Oh, I don't even know what the noise is happening right now, but it's... Uh... I can't explore this or anything? All right. They said let's go look in the forest, so... Is there by chance anything over here? No. That is just for scenery, got it. The music there is still serene, but now it's almost creepier. Like, it sounds nice, but I just keep thinking, you know, Basil's a goner. This does not sound as nice. Give me this butterfly! Why can't I catch you? I just freaked out a little. It's okay. Everything's alright. We'll be fine. Some delicious fruits. I could really use them now. Every time I hear that, <laughs> I just get excited. <laughs> Oh, you know what? We haven't talked to Mari. I wonder if she's gonna say something. Hold on. We're still in the prologue? This is a long game. I actually think I looked up the average completion time before I started this, and it said like 22 hours. Hi, Mori. Cliff faced as usual, I see. You should totally smile more. I've always liked your smile. So, do you need me to help you with anything? All it costs is your love. <laughs> I, I wasn't expecting this. Where could Basil be? Could he be somewhere in vast forests? Basil wouldn't just go off on his own like that. Maybe something happened to him. Hope to have helped just a little. I'll be here if you need me. Vast forest day. Okay. I thought this was vast forest. I guess it's not. Yeah, I don't- I, I'm like sitting here like, do I think this is nice music or creepy? I just- it's both. I didn't know that was really possible. It's soothing and creepy- whoa! Was that dead a second ago? These flowers, they're already dying. We should do our best to take care of them until Basil gets back. Oh, is that gonna be a reoccurring thing? Water the dying plants. That's why I couldn't water earlier. Yeah! Achievement unlocked! Green thumb! Oh, I don't think y'all saw that, but- Achievement unlocked! Yay! Train station pinwheel forest. Okay, well that's not vast for us, so maybe that's the previous one. I was about to talk to Mari again, and then I realized she'd probably just say the same thing. Um, is this vast forest? This looks foresty. Look, a lamp! Oh, there's fog here. Is this like Silent Hill? Are those grumpy flowers? What's a. I'm the Lorax, I speak for the trees! What are they called? These look like the Lorax trees! I like that. The, 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 the remake with the guy from The Office. It's got a catchy song in there. But for DMCA reasons, copyright strikes, I will not sing it, even though I really want to. Okay. Look, a giant spider web! I like spooters. Most people don't, but I do. They're cute. You are afraid of spiders. Amori's whoa, afraid of a lot of stuff. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I want to know what's happening, but also I don't want to die. Is it because the fear for interesting? I don't. Lots of thoughts happening up in here. Um. Okay. Well, if we're afraid of spiders, I guess we don't want to attempt to do that. So let's explore. There's other parts of the forest, right? On the other side. La 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 la. 
A pinwheel! Wait, is this still pinwheel forest? Where's vast forest? Does it say it on my map? It doesn't. There are 26 keys. Oh, wait. That's for letters of the alphabet, isn't it? <laughs> like, do, do I acknowledge that I said that, or...? Look, a ladder. Mushrooms! Oh, basil has got to be around here somewhere. Okay. Oh, it won't let me go up. Got it. We are not meant to go this way first. Okay. Alrighty then. Look, mushrooms over here. How do I get mushrooms? I can't. Alright. I guess we can't turn into Mario. I don't play enough Mario to even know what happens when... I mean, he eats the mushroom and he grows big. Like, what does that mean? What is it called? It's not like Super Sonic. Super Sonic's way cooler than a giant Mario. I realize this is a controversial take, but if you don't know me, you will know very quickly that I prefer Sonic. Anyway, before we get into that subject, look at Beach! Look at Smiley Face thing! Do you want to build sandcastles? I would like to build sandcastles. Whoa, dude. Is that Kel? Yep. Kel built a toilet! Oh, potty humor. I don't know what we made. Aubrey made bunnies. Hero made an actual castle, it looks like. This is cute. I think, I don't know, I kind of like the toilet. Toilet, the way I said that. Did they stay? Oh, no, they're gone now. Okay, I don't really know what the point of that was, but it's cute. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. What? I don't understand! I, like, want it to take me, but... You were afraid of drowning. I don't know, I feel like if we fall into that, something bad happens. But that's clearly where Basil was. I mean, that was the same thing. Okay, after Basil disappeared, we drew that in our sketchbook. We saw that in Basil's house, and now we've seen it there. That's gotta be like a, a symbol for Basil somehow. Right? Detective Tragic is on the case. We're gonna figure this out. But, um, I don't know if that means I need to explore somewhere else now, or what? You did not help anymore, Mari, but I appreciate your support. That's nice of you. Let's see if anything's different in the mirror now. Nope, okay. Basil is not creeping behind us in the mirror. Got it. Well, uh, let's go... Maybe I'm supposed to let my fear swallow me? To return to, like, the real world or something? I don't- it just doesn't- it, I don't know. It doesn't seem like that's what we want to do yet, if that's the case. Oh, Vast Forest! It was right here the whole time! That's exciting. Uh-oh, I see red footprints. They're up there. Did you see them? And a watermelon! A watermelon is what had, like, the doll at the beginning of the game. And a burb! This gives me vibes of, like, in Earthbound when we're trying to get to, what's it called? The, uh, the place where everybody's blue. Blue, blue. And you go through this creepy forest and trees attack you and explode and there's all sorts of craziness going on. Basil! Basil, where are you? I know. I bet my pet rock will know what to do. Hector, be a good boy. Go find Basil. <laughs> He's just a rock with a little... He's got a little face! It looks like when Sans drew like a snowman and under- Well, actually, I think he wrote his name on it in ketchup. Never mind, he didn't draw a face. I'm trying, I guess, to find Undertale Earthbound references. I wonder if I would have done this on my own had nobody told me that this is like Undertale. Hector talked. He did a dot dot dot. You tried your best, buddy. This is no time to fool around, Kel! Hey, why are you- Hector was just trying to help. Let it go, you two. We need to keep ourselves focused. I'm very focused. Hi, burp. Squat! Train station. Squat, squat! Foggy bridge. Thank you for giving me directions, Mr. or Mrs. Burp. Look, it's a bunny! Oh no, it's a mean bunny! I just wanted to be your friend. Do we have to attack it? We probably should be, like, leveling up and things, but it's such a... That's a cute bunny. What's this? You got tofu! I'm very excited at the amount of tofu. Are we vegetarians? 
I really should be battling. This is a problem of mine in RPGs. If I can run, I always do. But it's a cute Ben bun. Okay, this is clearly like bloody footprints. All right, fine. We'll fight this bunny. This one's angry. He attacked us first. Two of you! Okay, let's just straight up attack and go from there. I like- I'm really bad about that. E even like- <laughs> Oh, I forgot we can pass it! What did I do? I forgot how this works. Even when I played like Final Fantasy and stuff, like I- I- And magic is a huge part of that game. I'd rather just, you know- Uh... Well, our health is doing okay. Oh, and I lied. Kel is not doing super great. And we are sad. The more he didn't notice Aubrey, okay. I don't like that we're sad. Let's make... Yeah, let's give a pep talk to Amori. Wait, is this thing sad or angry? I'm really not sure. Wait, isn't sad good against... Maybe I messed this up. Let's see who goes first. No, he all turned to toast! I let that- that happened so fast! I have to pay attention, I can't just spam A, uh-oh. He's literally toast. Can I revive him, I wonder? Let's just keep attacking and see what happens after the battle. Last time they all turned to toast, after the battle they came back. So let's see if Hero is still toast or not. Also, who's gaining the experience? Us collectively? Oh look, he's fine, but... Oh, his health is- oh no. That was Kel, my bad. Okay, Kel's health is very low, so... I guess I already have to heal, which I don't love. Um, 5 heart, 30 heart. Let's give some candy to Kel. There we go. Okay, so let's follow the bloody footprints. I want to go this way, but the bloody footprints are here. Why is there only one footprint there? Look, it's not even. So maybe it's not Basil, because I'm pretty sure Basil had two legs. Or I'm just jumping to conclusions, because most of these are are two feet. Two feet? Two feet? Hello. I was, I think, trying not to attack, but it didn't really work. Okay, so... We don't want to be neutral. Shoot, I already forgot. I think sad is effective against happy, and happy is effective against angry. So... Let's make ourselves annoyed. So we can attack the sad bunny. I also totally forgot how this thing works with the... Uh, it's like up, down, left, I don't... Look at Amori. Oh, it does show the hands. Amori also, I think, is the only one with a legit weapon. He's got a creepy knife thing. Everybody else just kind of punches, I guess? I don't know. Okay, let's just keep attacking. I think we're doing okay. Hero's health is getting low, but... It's not super bad. Man, Kel got really angry. Forest Bunny was sad. Sorry, Forest Bunny. You attacked me. I wouldn't be fighting if I didn't have to fight you. I promise. Oh, crap! I used, I think... Wait, have I been able to attack since he got enraged? He's like really mad. Kel looks scary. Sorry, Kel. You annoyed yourself, technically? Yeah, Kel, okay. Okay, so it's sad is strong against happy. Or is it the other way around? No, that seemed pretty legit. I, th I think the way the pyramid was, maybe it was sad is weak to happy and happy is weak to angry and angry is weak to sad. I don't know, now I'm confused. We'll figure it out. I did say I'd forget that in like two minutes, and I have proven correct. Look, it's a tentacle again! A tentacle is poking out of the ground. What are you doing here, tentacle? What's over there? Mushrooms! They do nothing. A watermelon! I'm so sorry, I'm yelling so much. Okay. We slashed it. Whoa! Okay, let's go this way because there are footprints there. La 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 la. Okay, getting creepier. I'm nervous. Ooh, cold chill. Okay. <laughs> oh no! There is a fork in the path. I don't know why it shows up. Oh no, nah, maze! Hmm. I don't know, guys. I don't think Basil's in this forest. But we haven't even searched the whole forest yet. We can't stop now. 
Cheer up, Aubrey. We'll keep searching until we find him. If we don't find Basil soon, maybe we should meet up with Mari at the playground and figure out what to do from there. So, I feel like it was telling me I should move forward. That's Basil! Whoa! How do we get over there? Maybe it's the ladder we already found elsewhere. Okay, okay! I don't know why I'm just now pressing A, but it, it didn't look like I could jump over there or anything. I'm pretty sure that was Basil. I mean, not 100%, but... Well, so it was another missing child. Oh, look, a key! Nice. Ugh, the noise it plays here is not good. I'm a little scared. And it always leaves this black hole. Hmm. Let's look at our hangman. B. Nope, okay, I was gonna guess Basil is that third word, but that doesn't make sense, because A is third. Brave. B. Brave. Nope, I don't know. <laughs> What's over here? Where art thou? No, I don't want to ban- oh, I'm always running away. I have to be brave like I saw in my hangman that probably wasn't saying that. Okay, so I'm gonna make Hero mad again. Cook. Wait, who am I right now? Oh. I didn't mean Hero, I meant Kel. That's fine. Yeah, yeah, Mori can attack twice. Ready's the blade. Okay, so now I can't use any of these little team things anymore. I mean, no! I think we'll be able to heal soon, right? Hopefully. Oh no, I'm more sad now! I don't know, maybe that's fine. Are they all attacking twice? I haven't really been counting. I mean, I think they're only going once, but it feels like they're going twice. Okay, so that was Kel. Kel did one. Amori did one. Aubrey did one. And Hero gets one. Okay, never mind. They just feel like long turns? I don't really know why. Doo -doo. We'll just keep attacking because we're doing okay on health. Also, it's dead now. Bye! Amori's part of is victorious! Oh, level four! Level four! Level four! I don't know what. So excited for four. Okay, let's go. Do, do, do. I wonder if I was supposed to go this way. I probably need to heal and burn a heal and save soon. Bum, 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 bum. <sighs> this would be helpful if I could remember if happy's or if if happy if sad is good against happy or not. I'm gonna make myself sad. Let's see what happens. And then I'm also going to make... Gosh darn it, I keep thinking... Of... Okay. The, the turns are out of order. It's Amori, Aubrey, Kel, Hero. Oh crap. I just hit my mic. I thought it would be like, bloop, but it's like, bloop, bloop, bloop. You know what doesn't... I don't know, it's not what I thought. Okay. Anyway... Let's keep it tight. Forest Bunny winks at Hero. He's a happy little bunny winking at me. Why do I have to kill you? I wonder if I should be trying to run. I haven't tried in a while. <laughs> Aubrey looks at Amori. Does that make Amori attack again? They're chatting, little... Yep, okay. Oh, didn't notice. Wait, why didn't I notice? Because I'm sad, or what? Let's just keep attacking at this point. I'm testing the... Nope, not annoy. I'm testing the angry and sad thing again, because, you know, I'd rather just test it in battle than actually take the time to look. Uh, health is okay. Juice. Juice is okay, too. Alright, we're doing alright. Law Sprout Mole. Wait, what? Oh, that was the name of it. I didn't see what it actually did. It's just attack something or other. It's fine. It's fine. It was a moving attack. Kel is the one who- Oh, Kel took no damage on that one. Kel and here- Oh, no, everybody's health is kind of low at this point. Okay. Oh, Aubrey grew to level 4. Hero grew to level 4. Where's Kel? Is it because Kel died? I'm afraid I'm, like, diving deep into this forest I don't need to be diving deep into yet. Oh, no, the blade footprints! Okay, hold on, I saw a watermelon over here. Let's get the watermelon. Watermelon! A dandelion! 
Nope, I don't feel like battling you. I saw Bloody Footprints, I'm going this way. Man, I love dandelions. When I was little, it, it would upset me so much when my dad would, because, you know, they're weeds. My dad would kill them. I'd be like, no, I want to wait till they're old and I can make wishes on them. Yes, I am running away from everything. Gosh darn it. Okay, good. This one, there's only one here. I think we might need to start healing. Good thing I bought some items. Holy cow. I mean, you would think if I cared a little bit more, I would stop running from them. So I can level up, but... Level up! And also, okay, noticing, so Aubrey and Hero, I think, leveled up last time. Their health did not replenish. So leveling up does not heal. I was kind of hoping it would. There's a lot in this forest. Okay, keep following the footprints. I can't pick up these mushrooms. Gosh darn it, bunny. What? I think it's time to heal. Okay. Um... We all need to heal. Juice, juice. I don't need any more juice. I should have bought more candy. I didn't know. I have a feeling, though, that we won't encounter... Um, Mari here. If we find her in, like, the next two seconds and we're able to save and heal, I'm gonna be peeved. Here's that stupid bunny thing. La 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 la. Oh. I successfully ran away. Okay, that's fine. We'll probably have to attack in a couple minutes here anyway. Oh, look, here's the ladder. Okay. This is a pretty long ladder, huh? Yeah, it's pretty tall. Not as tall as the one east of the stump. The one goes all the way up to space. You're really afraid of heights, aren't you, Amori? It's okay. We don't have to look up there. But we do. <gasps> what? I came all this way for nothing, didn't I? I think I did. I think we're gonna have to use the ladders eventually, but for now, maybe I was supposed to find Mari. Well, I mean, I just healed, so let's, let's try to level up along the way here. Do, 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 do. Wait, is that one angry? Let's give a pep talk to... Uh, Kel. I can't get over every time it says Amori readies his blade and he just sits there like stone faced. I don't, I don't know, it's pretty weird. You can do it! Oh no, I hit the wrong button again. I guess I shouldn't have come here. I, th I think I came here too early. Which I kind of- TOAST! I already healed him too! I'm leaving you as toast. I'm out of items. I was not prepared for this. Do, 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 do. Yeah, you can't call Kel. He's literally toast. I ate toast for lunch today and now I'm just sitting up eating. Good, we found candy! GGS. Okay, so... I don't, I'm confused why I couldn't go up the ladder following these footprints, but I think we're supposed to go back to Mari, so I'm, I'm just gonna go back to Mari and, and see what happens from there. Um, is this where we came from? Yeah. Yeah, 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 because we ran from that bunny already. Nope! Bye! I'm too busy trying to progress with the story that I think I messed up with progressing on. Nope. La 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 la. Running away from enemies like I run away from my problems. I almost did a thanks career point. I mean, that kind of was a thanks career point. <laughs> Okay, so we already saw Basil up there. Do, 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 do. This is way creepy and the fighting or the fighting and forest music was more upbeat. 
Okay, now I gotta go all the way through this forest again. Oh, wait, we didn't go up there, though. Let's find Mari first. I feel like I'm getting ahead of myself here. And then I, I don't like to just do a bunch of backtracking, which there is high potential to start occurring here. I got apple juice! I don't know how to get out of here, I'm lost help! Train station. I'm just curious. There are people here! You know what, we're gonna come back. There is a dog, a hot dog dog. Oh my gosh, okay. Yeah, we'll come back to that. It's too soon. Oh, look, there's another watermelon. Uh... Hi, my name is Tragic, and I run from bunnies. Life jam! That sounds like we can bring things back to life. And by things, I mean partners. Cherry soda! Wowie. Chocolate! We have to fight that one for the last watermelon. Why are you upside down? Are you okay, forest bunny? Just gonna keep attacking. Kel's about to die. But the bunny died first. Perfect. We found candy! And learned rebound. What could that mean? Give me that watermelon. I got banana smoothie! And a three-leaf clover! We're gonna have to check out all these items there because we picked up a lot in here. Stupid bunny. Can't even get over here. I thought I liked bunnies, I've changed my mind. How do we exit this forest? La 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 Okay, bye. Okay, bye! There's a watermelon. Oh good, this is where we started. Okay, perfect. Okay, so let's go back to Mari. I don't think these were here before. This is new. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, this is definitely new. 100% new. 10,000% new. Okay, let's definitely heal. Oh, it forced me over here. Hello, everyone. How is it going? Have you found Basil yet? Hey, Mari. No luck so far, I'm afraid. Oh. I'm sorry, guys. I wish there was a way I could help more. We're all doing our best. Maybe we should start looking outside the forest. Light bulb! I know! Why don't we try climbing that really long ladder? The one east of the stump, the one I looked at. We can't do that! Amori is afraid of heights! But what if Basil is somewhere up there? We gotta take our chances. I know, but... Amori, you're growing stronger and stronger every day. You can handle climbing a ladder, can't you? Come on, little brother, face your fears. She's our sister! She's dead! I know it! She's totally dead! Our sister is dead! I'm already stressing! I'm not ready for this! Was Basil our brother? <laughs> I, yeah, I'm freaking out a lot. I'm just expecting the worst here. It's natural to be nervous at first, but you should know that we all believe in you. Come on, Amori. Just one measly little ladder. What's the worst that can happen? You could die. I don't know about this. Do you think you're gonna be okay, Amori? I mean, yeah. I will be okay. Okay, if you're okay with it, then I'm okay with it too. But if you get scared, you can always count on me to back you up. Thanks, Amori. You've got some real courage. Woohoo! Let's go, let's go to the ladder east of the stump! We'll see you later, Mari! Bye now, stay safe! Remember, Amori, you're stronger than you think! Let's heal! Nice! Oh, we should probably buy some more items, but I'll do that in between episodes. Unit friends feeling new! Let's save! Are we still in the prologue? We are still in the prologue. All right! I think this is a good stopping point. I've been recording for almost an hour. Um, there's some backtracking in there, but yeah, this feels like a good place to stop. Well, y'all, thank you for watching part three of my mini YouTube series with Amori. Things are getting real. There's bloody footprints, we're seeing shadows. I, I'm coming up with all sorts of theories already. I, I feel like this game is gonna go from zero to 100 really quick but i am super excited to be playing it and to see what's coming next i'm super excited that you're hanging out with me thank you so much for for watching this for watching the other two 
assuming you watched the other two if you got this far. <laughs> and I hope y'all are enjoying this as, as much as I'm enjoying playing it. So I will be coming up with an uploading schedule hopefully soon. I think I'm gonna be able to do two or three videos a week, no promises yet, but I'm super excited to see this all come together. I can't wait to show y'all to hear what you think. And this is where we're gonna end it today. So I will see y'all next time. It's all out. Thank you.